Hey folks, it's Frithgar here, how you doing? Welcome back to Two Point Hospital. Put that in there, we need to keep all the files in place. I don't have any, but like the book, diagnostic bookcase, that'd be pretty cool. Psychi psychiatric books that improve diagnostics ability. That'd be quite nice, I've got 120 points. Changing screen, now the lamp. See, all of these different ones to unlock. With all the K points, but I don't have that many K points at the moment, so we won't unlock any more. Uh, prestige level 2 on there. I mean, more prestige would probably be nice. Let's put another... We'll put a second Rorschach poster in. I think the Rorschach poster is sort of quite an important aspect of this. And then we can put a little bit of informational jargon nonsense stuff up here. Sort of light-headed poster like that. Um, I test we won't... The, the Jasmine picture, we can put another one on the wall. And there we've now got um, level three. Psychiatry, all done. Let's, let's, let's spin around. There we go. Proper psychiatry going on right in there. So then I want to go to higher and I want to go to doctors. And I need a psychiatrist. General practice, treatment, diagnostics, stamina training. Uh, I need somebody that's able to do the psychiatry stuff. Without an actual trained psychiatrist, I'm not, I'm, I'm not going to be able to do anything. I only have one doctor at the moment. Stamina. Increased GP diagnosis skills in a GP office. 10% treatment skills. That one there is diagnosis skills. What have you got? You've got diagnosis and... In right, well, that's actually a perfect doctor for working in that office over there. So I don't need that. Treatment skills are the ones that I want. So Mickey Pumps is the dude that I want. Let's hire him and he can go in here. Psychiatry qualification is required. All right, well, that's just great. How do I get rid of him? I don't want him. Oh, right click. There we go. Higher. Is there a way to increase hospital to level 5 to unlock? Well, I don't want all. I want doctors. Hmm. I'm going to I'm just going to have to keep an eye on the doc. When do I get another doctor available? How often do they change over? Motivated, terribly dull, the boy next door, he's a party trick. Target of unrequited idolization, heartthrob, m makes people bored, works faster than normal speed, plus 20% speed. He's probably not the best one for a psychiatrist, to be honest. I'll leave the psychiatrist for a minute, as there's not a lot that I can do about that. So we will go back to... Right, great news, the two-point health ministry has granted us a training license. This will allow us to train staff in all of our hospitals. Building, building a training room allows you to run a training course. Staff with a free training slot can go on a course to learn a new qualification. So, I want a new doctor so that I can train. Flottering has had a bit of a problem recently. Clowns. They're everywhere. Apparently, they keep escaping from the traveling circus. Their hijinks can be a real nuisance. We'll need some new equipment to deal with them. The Orb Foundation have, patented, have a patented method for recalibrating the minds of clowns, supporting their rehabilitation back into society. They have offered to supply us with the necessary equipment if we can demonstrate our ability to mold our own staff. Sounds a bit sinister to me, but who am I to judge? <laughs> oh, this is brilliant. I love this game. I love this game. Well, I've hardly played it at all yet, and I absolutely love this game. Right. 17 days, we get a new applicant. I'll just see if we get a psychiatrist come through in 15 days. In the meantime, we will build a new training office. So we've got ward, staff room, toilets, deluxe clinic, pans lab, training. Minimum three by three. Right, I don't have space for three by three just yet. So, uh, no, so the two by twos. We'll, we'll put training in here. I put that. With the middle in there. That one... Doctor to psychiatry, please. I don't have anyone that can go in there. Right. That one there. Like that. And then... It's going to have to go this way around. 
Quite a few of our staff have free training slots. There. Five of those in there. Why is it? Whenever you clip your nails in front of a computer, one of the nails always flies into the cracks of your keyboard. Does the keyboard feed on them? I don't know. No one knows. That is the single greatest question I have ever heard. Why do the fingernail clippings disappear into your keyboard? Nobody knows. That is absolutely fantastic. Right, we've got a training room, so I will just okay that one. To start a training course, click on the lectern or drop a suitable member of staff into the room. Staff will also request training when they're ready. In the training screen, select qualification you want staff to learn, assign a trainer, and select the staff you wish to send on this course. When you're ready, click Start button. When picking a trainer, you can use your own staff, choosing one of their qualifications to teach, or you can pay extra to bring in a guest trainer. Right. First up here. New illness discovered, misery guts. <laughs> Doctors have discovered a new illness called misery guts. Chronic grumpiness due to nihilistic semicolon. We'll send the patient for treatment in our pharmacy. <laughs> oh, I love this game. This, this is fantastic. Okay, I'm down to $76,000. We've got to watch this a little bit. So, what's the clown doing? Called into room. Feeling duration 24 days. Not quite sure what he's... Diagnosis certainty, 75%. So, I'm not quite sure what's going on with the clown there. Seven grand there. We just we have a psychiatry room, but we don't have a doctor with a psychiatry qualification. No, we don't. That is a problem for me. Staff training required. Nigella Banoffi has gained lots of experience on the job. They'll be ready for promotion to junior nurse once they've completed some training. A new qualification will give them increased abilities. Current zero. Promotion from student nurse to student nurse to junior nurse will provide a training slot and then ten percent motivation, diagnosis, and treatment skill. There are four other members of staff ready for training. Train now. Four trainees available. So who have I got? I got head assistant. I got another junior nurse there. Chief nurse and a janitor. So I'll bring another junior nurse in. There. So that we've got both of these ready for doing some training. And then... Trainees, tra courses available now. Diagnostics, pharmacy management. Now, I do need two nurses with pharmacy. I got one with pharmacy management. Staff with this qualification, two. And able to learn, two. Stamina training, emotional intelligence, bedside manner, motivation, training, masterclass, increased teaching and learning speed in a training room, ward management. I guess that would... I'm going to go with the pharmacy management for now. And I'll train both of these nurses in it. So I will take that one there. And trainers available. I can have a nurse do the training or bring in a guest trainer. 10 grand. That's going to cost me 20 grand to have that person do it. Or I have one of my own nurses do it. I don't know how long a course takes. Estimated duration unknown. I've got my chief nurse up here. She's pretty good. Teaching speed 140%, teaching speed 120 So if I put him in over a month, is that one, it's going to... 10 grand plus another 10 grand, that's 20,000, but I don't use up um, another one of my nurses. I'm going to have two nurses taken off the thing to do this anyway and i don't really want to use another one up so i think i'd be better off doing it like spending the 20 grand either that or i have to hire another nurse to take up their space so i will do it like this we'll start training we hope you've enjoyed your stay but please eventually leave <laughs> and we hope you've enjoyed your stay but please leave uh so then i want to go Doctor back to needed in gp's office okay hire new applicant in one day what I want. Please have training masterclass. I'm going to hire this one because she's got the training masterclass, which is actually quite good. So we'll sort of use her as a graduate. 
She can go in there. Not... Right, we can upgrade our easy scan to make it more effective. You select the item and choose it. Where's the, that's the easy scan there, isn't it? Upgrade over 37 days. You over here, you're already upgraded. Right, well, leave that one. I've got a course busy training over here, so I will leave that one training. This one here, upgrade to the level 2 drug mixer. Uh, I've got... Someone there is he's off on a break at the moment. I'm still waiting for psychiatry. I'm going to end up losing a patient soon. Train a staff member. So once the training has been done over here, then I will be able to you utilize other people because you're going to like we can only do one estimated duration in another 26 days. Right, what have we got? Pan's lab. Our docs have discovered a new illness, Pan's Lab. Involuntary attachment to kitchen utensils caused by extremely low levels of culinary skill. The pan must be carefully removed with a massive magnet. It will cost 20000 to build. Get patient to wait. A group of ward patients were kicked out of a jumbo hospital for questioning treatment methods and are now looking for further treatment. We'll be rewarded if we treat this group of patients. Should we set them here? Have them sent here. Challenge cure eight patients with monobrow. Treatment room, ward, one in the hospital, time limit 90 days. Yes. Patients now arriving for the ward. Right, so we've got to cure a load of patients with the dreaded illness of <laughs> monobrow, which is fantastic. Uh, this is Ricky Hawthorne on Two Point Radio. This is Ricky Hawthorne, bringing talk, music, and news to the whole of Two Point County. And if you're listening to us from the newly opened hospital, just turn up that volume, because nothing drowns out the sound of sick people like the voice of a world-class DJ. Coming up next, 42 hours of music from the background band. Enjoy! <laughs> Okay, we will drown out the sounds of our sick people. Our docs have discovered a new illness, monobrow. Extreme hair growth caused by excessive consumption of both highbrow and lowbrow entertainment. The monobrow must be carefully removed and placed in a secure container to prevent it from escaping. <laughs> we'll set the patient for treatment in our ward. I love it. I absolutely love it. Right, oh dear. I've only got ten grand... Which means that I can't do the Pan's Lab treatment. Now, I've got a spare doctor floating around, which is a bit of a problem for us. I don't have a receptionist at the moment. Oh, he's coming back now. Um, I can't build a Pan's Lab because I don't have the 20 grand. Pause. I want to build a Pan's Lab. Rooms. I mean, if I can get the Pan's Lab built, that would be quite cool. Pan's Lab there, 20,000. Am I able to take a loan out? Profits and losses. A loan would be nice. Your inbox. Staff. Money. Finance. Ah! In the Finance tab, you can access Business Overview screen for a deep dive on all aspects of the hospital. You can also adjust the prices you charge in this hospital and take out a loan if you need more cash. I do need more cash because this dude's going to require 10 grand at the end of his thing. Uh, prices in here. Adjust the prices you charge for diagnosis, treatment, other things in the hospital. On establishing a new hospital, the prices default to market rate for that location. Visitors will be willing to pay these prices. Increasing prices will bring in more money but can damage your reputation and cause patients to storm out. Decreasing will bring in less money but can help boost your reputation. Right, well, I don't want to adjust prices at the moment. I want to leave them exactly as they are. I don't want to be changing anything. Um, monobrow treatment is eight grand. Eight and a half grand for the pandemic. Misery guts, seven grand. Psychiatry with a Freudian lips, 6,000. So these are things that I want to be able to treat. I don't have a doctor yet, though. Uh, a psychiatrist. Here you can view loan offers from a range of companies. Take out loans and repay existing loans. Each loan company offers a different amount of money with a monthly repayment based on the repayment period and interest rate. Some loan offers will only become available once the hospital meets certain criteria. You can adjust the amount you want to borrow before taking out the loan using the slider. Once you've taken out a loan, you can repay it at any time as long as you have enough money. Right. On here. 50 grand at 5% per annum, pay 2,194 per month for 24 months. 
Or I can pay 4600 per month for 24 months and get 100000 from swindles. I'm going to go to Two Point Bank and get 50 grand rather than go to the swindles. There, just like that. And then I'm going to go back to rooms over here and I'm going to get a pans lab. A minimum of a 4x4 four four is required for this bad boy. So that's going to tuck into that corner right there. And then I will put that one on there. And then I've got the actual treatment machine here. Which way round does that need to go? It needs to go that way round. And we'll put that over into that corner there. And then I want to just make the room look reasonable. Prestige is set at level 2 at the moment. We want to put those in. We want to put a fire extinguisher in. Plants, they don't cost a great deal. So it's definitely worth putting a few plants in to gain a little bit of extra prestige. And we'll put in a couple of posters. I'll put a light-headed poster in over here. And I'll put a Jasmine Odyssey poster. Always want a Jasmine Odyssey poster because it does a lot for the prestige, that does. And a chair. We can have a couple of chairs so that people can just, just wait off to the side. There's two chairs. I think that's everything that I want. Is there anything else? I don't need a window going in. We don't want people looking in. So I will do that right there. 20,630. I've got that one ready. So who do I need to run this one? Doctor required. Well, I've got a spare doctor. I've got two doctors at the moment. So I've got one doctor in here. And that is her. Treatment skills, increased happiness, diagnostics, and training masterclass. That is actually my training doctor. Uh, Susie Cucumber is the head assistant. So where's my other doctor? I've got another doctor somewhere, but I don't know where she's gone. Somewhere I had a... Who's that? Garth Pebble. Appointment for psychiatry. Yeah, he's still waiting. He's been here for 108 days. That's, that's not so good. That's that's really not so good, that's not. i got two nurses in there. Where's the other doctor gone? I had a second doctor here somewhere. I don't know where they are. Does that can I, can anybody see her? Well, I'm assuming that I don't. No, I don't need to go looking for them like this, do I? I go character staff like that. There. On a break, on call, working in the GP's office. So this one here increased GP diagnostic skills, and increases diagnostic skills. So that person there I want. And then this one here who has treatment skills. Lucy Fenderson. Right, so Candida. Lucy, you're going to go over and work in that room. And there, Dr. Candida, who is on call, is going to go and work in the GP's office like that. There. Right, I think that's working all right. So let's let's just press play on that. She's going to stay there. I've now got someone with the pans lab. I've got the monobrow treatment. They're on their way. I've got the pan lab treatment. They're on their way. Mayoral visit. Mayor Tabitha Winsock is refuting the claim that all of her initiates containing all of her initiatives. Oh, is refuting the claim that all of her initiatives contain the word thing. With that's not my with the that's not my thing initiative, it's really unclear what it's about, if anything, beyond that. But her team have asked if we'd like to uh, to uh, if we'd like to host a visit. If she's impressed with the hospital, it could be good for our reputation. What do you think? Challenge: impress the VIP with a nice hospital. Yes, I'm sure you know, we can do I've it. I've been humming that tune to myself all week, which is uncanny because I've never heard it before. Or have I? Oh well, more catchy music coming right up. All right. Join okay. me in welcoming the mayor to the hospital. Right, the mayor is coming into the hospital. I've got pharmacy calling nurse. Janitor with mechanics required. I think, does that 
get done automatically? Did you know if hygiene levels are low, the health of patients will deteriorate faster? Keep the hospital as clean as possible. Make sure toilets have sinks and place hand sanitizer dispensers. Oh, I haven't done that. I haven't placed any hand sanitizer dispensers. So let's go to items over here. I have not been... I have been negligent in my duties. Where is the hand sanitizer? Aircon, small ice sculpture, cozy kiosk, drinking fountain. Okay, there is... There's a lot of stuff here. Hand sanitizer. Hand. Hand sanitizer. I need 150k points to do that. So I can't unlock it at the moment, but that is something that we're going to need. Right, well, that's worth keeping in mind. Now, you over here, you should have somebody coming in soon. Uh, I've also got Clown Clinic. Our docs have discovered a new illness. A jest infection. <laughs> A condition that causes hijinks and general buffoonery. Escaped clowns must have their sense of humor completely excised to prevent a future relapse. The patient is seeking treatment. We will need a clown clinic in order to treat them. Complete more objectives to unlock clown clinic. Get the patient to wait. We're nearly done with our training session, which means we'll then be able to unlock the clown clinic. You over there, you need to be repaired. This one is upgrading the easy scan. I need someone who's able to do repair work. Keep that running. Well, she's upgrading, so she's almost done. Once she has finished, we'll then be able to work on this one. That one is finished over there. No, it's not. It's in the process of being upgraded. However, it can still be used. Upgraded to easy scan two. Clown Eight. clinic unlocked. Nigella Banoff is ready for promotion from student nurse to junior nurse. Promotion to... From student to junior, will provide one training slot. Right. New salary, 16. I was increasing salary previously until... Just until I get them to go to the smiley face. So I think we will do that. Right, promote. There. So she's now very, very happy. And you are done. Leaving the hospital. In progress, eight. Announcement. Plants need water. <laughs> okay. That one there is being done. That one's being repaired. That's good. I've got the... Jasmine Odyssey is back, and there's no getting rid of her. The hit album, Salivation, features unmissable singles like Oh No, Not Again. Oh No, Not Again. And ain't no feeling like the feeling I feel when I'm feeling feelings. Okay. Rain, no feeling like the feeling I feel when I'm feeling feelings. Stream Jasmine Odyssey today on Bungle Music. This <laughs> <laughs> DJ stuff is brilliant, isn't it? Right, we've got a staff challenge. Nigella Benoff is a request for us. I'm not usually one for suggestions, but the other day I had this great idea. I can't stop thinking about it. What if we were to, like, cure some people? Wouldn't that be cool? Challenge, cure 10 patients. Time limit, 90 days. Rewards, plus 20% happiness and 10k points. Except. I'm sure we can do it. I'm sure we have it within us to do this. I don't have anybody assigned into this room. I need to get somebody in this room, don't I? Nurse required. Although nobody's actually been... Potion, patients processed one. Which is not great. Uh, extract a pan. Q length zero. We've only got one person done in there. I've got Dr. Lucy in there. I'm still waiting on a psychiatrist. Let's just go to hire again. We've got our doctors here. Psychiatry. Yes, Aaron McCarthy. Right. You are the dude that I need. Hire you. Drop you in there. I need a psychiatrist. Excellent. That'll save me having to train a psychiatrist. So I've got my three doctors are now working. So I, I kind of need extra people in order to be able to get more training going on. Because I've got to promote three staff. Train th I trained two people in there. I trained two of them. Didn't I? Sure, I trained two of them. Trained them in pharmacy management. Oh, well. They should... I, I believe they automatically go to the right places when 
We have things going on. Oh, wait, no. Uh, there is one more thing. Our staff promotion. Candida Pebble is ready for promotion from junior doctor to doctor. Promotion will require will provide a training slot. Uh, I do need to increase her salary ever so slightly. So that she is happy in her work. There we go. Promote right there. And start training. Now, I have seven trainees available. These two here, Dr. Lucy Fenderson and Dr. Aaron McCarthy, are both able to do some good training. But I think increase teaching and learning speed in a training room. But then you've got to have the other, so they, they can learn faster, but they can't do anything else. So someone else being treated with, psychi with learning psychiatry would probably be good. Um, I don't want to overdo it. So Dr. Candida is available to learn a new bit of training. So I'm going to take the doctor in here like that. So just click on her like that. Uh, chief nurse, junior nurse, janitor. Courses available for the doctor. We've got stamina, emotional intelligence. They so I, I've got a few of those that can be general practice two. Trainees, staff with staff able to learn. So that increases the treatment skill. Diagnostics two. Plus ten percent diagnosis. That would probably be good. I, I've got three people that are able to learn that. So if I put that one in there like that. Trainees available are Nurse Lillian Shambles, who's our chief nurse. I'd actually like her treatment to be... I don't know. Because she's already got... Di I suppose actually diagnostics, we've got the ward management, so she's already pretty good with that. So if I was to train her further on here, I mean, it's either that or I go with Dr. Lucy, who's a, that's the second doctor. I don't really want the second doctor. You know what? I will go with the nurse in here. We'll keep the training going like this. I think this is going to be a good thing to do. And then trainers available. I've got to bring in a guest trainer. Good grief. Uh, that's not something I'm going to do. It's 10,000 plus 10,000 per person. I need to do the clown thing first. I need to set up a new room. It's very important that we do the clown thing. We've got the Pans Lab, Clown Clinic. That's 20 grand. And that's got to be a 4x4. Four four. So that's going to go into that slot right there. That one's going to go there. <laughs> a, dehumor a dehumifier. Right, we've got the dehumifier right here. Which which way round do we put? I'm going to put that one in that corner like that. That, that thing looks slightly <laughs> horrific, I will be honest. That does look slightly horrific in there. And I want an extinguisher to go there. And we'll put a, a, a plant in here. And what else can we put? I think they're going to need the Rorschach poster after this treatment. And we will use the Jasmine Odyssey poster. Because everybody loves Jasmine Odyssey. And then a cannon. Originally used in the Siege of Flemington. <laughs> okay. Uh, a, a, a couple of chairs, I guess. We put, we'll put a, a couple of these down that side down there. And that will do quite nicely, I should think. We'll put that one there like that. So what do I need in here? Nurse required in here. So I'm going to want to hire another nurse. I've actually got... Like, no, I don't have a nurse going into this room in here. I've got four nurses at the moment. I've got one, two... Well, I think that's quite enough care and loving attention inflicted upon the patients from myself for today. So we will return next time. In the meantime, if you have enjoyed this episode, then could you please head down below and give us a like. And if you really enjoyed it, then please tell your friends all about me. Get them to come and watch as well. That would be awesome. And until next time, thank you very much for watching. This is Frithgar. Goodbye and see you later.